hold this, I uh, go ahead and wait, stop. Hammer time. <laughs> it's hammer time. <laughs> With, uh... So today, we're gonna show them how to do this with one of these. <laughs> oh, geez. Welcome to the channel. What's up, makers? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Nate Javier, and I'm here with my good friends, Ben and Casey Woo! of LDBF. Guys, welcome. Thank you so much for joining me. Appreciate it. It's uh, it's, it's exciting to be here, and we know it's exciting because the gens are freaking out behind the camera. Yes, the gens <laughs> are right there behind the camera freaking out. Uh, and if you guys can't notice, uh, we're actually at Stereo Brewing, Woo! hanging out, prepping some stuff. Uh, coming up is the LDBF Droptoberfest. You want to tell Drop our people about it? Droptoberfest. What's the date, Ben? September 26th. I nailed it on the last one. Oh yes, it's a nailed it. it's a live nailed it. It's, yeah. a, it's a live event that we get to have fun drinking with all you guys at home, socially distanced with great, amazing local craft beers. Yes, and make sure you guys go down to the description below, grab a ticket, check Please. out these guys, check out the uh, pack of uh, amazing craft beer that you get yeah. amongst uh, all sorts of entertainment. Uh, amongst other things, <laughs> yes. we also have bands great and other things. Entertainment. <laughs> So please check that out uh, if you can. And uh, gentlemen, I want to show you one of the greatest things I've ever learned. And I'm, we're going to teach you guys how to do it the right way. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so from the intro, you guys saw uh, I just pulled everything out of my nose. This is the human blockhead. Uh, my, one of my favorites. At the, Actually, at the uh, Last Drop Beer Fest, you guys saw yeah. uh, the, one of the <laughs> lovely gens pull a nail out of my nose. That is the human blockhead, and it's one of the coolest things. Producer Jen hated that trick. Producer Jen <laughs> loved that trick and her pet nail spike. This is not spike, this is something else. I do carry around quite often a box of nails. These are 20 penny nails, uh, five inches long, I think. Yep. And uh, super simple. I'm not going to start you guys off on this. I'd appreciate that. Uh, instead, we're going to use uh, Q tips. Super simple. Hey, perfect. That's how you get your COVID test. Yes. <laughs> exactly you. how you get your uh, fun virus test. Do this uh, Poco, uh, maybe. Yes, do it Poco, please. <laughs> uh, and if you guys can, uh, remember, I'm just showing you how I do it and teaching these guys. Don't try this at home. Go to a neighbor's house instead. Uh, <laughs> or a brewery. Yeah, or a brewery. <laughs> uh, if you are over 21, you're responsible for yourself. Uh, so, guys, let's cheers and let's get into it. Clink it and drink it, boys. Ah. Sweet. All right. So let's talk human blockhead. Oh, uh, boy. Boys, if you will, choose a Q-tip, any Q-tip. Yeah. Ah. If you will. Yeah. We're going to get up close and personal. Yep, and I'm going to go ahead and use the nail just because uh, I've already practiced. You're a professional, I get yep. it. Uh, so... Believe it or not, you don't go up. That's the number one thing. So people think when you do a human blockhead, you nail it straight up. Up is bad. That's how you get a lobotomy. Yeah. <laughs> That's not how you do it, Ben. That's not how you do it. That's not how you do it. <laughs> yeah. no. That's not it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, so human We're blockhead actually happens. Uh, ben, if you can, stick your hand out just like this. You're going to be the nail. So inside your nostril, you have like the floor of your nostril and this little sinus flap. Uh, the nail goes in straight, go ahead, and goes underneath the sinus flap and into the back of the throat. Uh, that's the same kind of thing we're gonna do. So if you take your Q-tip and as long as you kind of point it slightly downward, not too far down, because we're not digging in, yeah, you're just gonna let it guide underneath the uh, sinus flap that's there. If you go up, that's a lobotomy and that's really bad. No uh, lobotomies today. No lobotomies. And you'll find that you actually have a dominant nostril. So if you stick your nose up, go straight in, 
You'll feel it slide slightly under the strap, uh, the, the flap. Oh. It feels really weird. Your eyes are going to start watering and it's going to feel really weird. There we go. <laughs> Casey got it. <laughs> I'm going to start my own channel. Sorry. Right? There we no. go. And then no. Casey. And then well, ben's, ben's got it too. What's really fun is with the nail, if you get it just right, you can get it to slowly slide down on its own. I'm going to try to see if I have a I dominant. definitely feel like it's touching my brain right now. Yeah. So it's actually in the back of your throat. That's where it ends well, up. Well, see, talk about dominant. Talk about dominant. Nostrils? Nostrils, because I tried the other one, and I feel like it went the other a little further. Yeah, and it just makes it that much easier. So I got boogers? I've definitely got mucus, though. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> next time I'm having, like, uh, like, because I, I got some sinus issues. I'm going to try that next time. Like, man, I can't Very breathe. Nice. So nice. now that you guys got that down, uh, oh, I will gosh. actually, if you guys are down for it, I'm gonna let Casey do it. He's he's much more. Pro oh, yep, there it goes. Look at that. And if you want to do oh, this God, again, I, think with I just forgot my phone number, Nate. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want to try that this with your uh, Q-tip, that's exactly what those are there for. Oh, I know what's up. So here's the thing. So I'm gonna give you guys performance tips. Yes, you can do this with Q-tips. You can do it with crayons. I just crayons. Like, Cray oh, crayons would be fun. Yes, uh, or nails. Uh, I know a guy who can do it with a six inch uh, spike, like Woo. almost like a railroad spike, just all the way in. And I don't know how he does it. It's all up to him. So first off, uh, practice. Practice, yes. That's what you have the uh, Q-tips Q -tips for. for. Yep. Uh, one of my favorite things to do is actually use one of the wet naps, wipe, wipe it down, wipe down the nail, make sure you get everything off of it. Um, you should see the producer Jens freaking out right now. I love it. It's totally It's the same gonna thing. Here we go. Here it's not we go. gonna go for it. It's not any different than, than <laughs> Why? It's alright. It'll you won't feel remember anything in 15 minutes anyway. <laughs> oh I feel like that's about as far as there I There you go. go. Yeah. Yeah. For my first time that's not too bad. That's actually really good. So after you get it uh, all situated into your sinus Woo. See, I can't. Just, I can't do that. Just, that's fine. I'm too. I'm too. <laughs> One of my favorite things is actually uh, in the presentation having somebody hold on to it. And if you watch the video back with uh, Jen pulling this out of my nose, what I'll do is kind of scrunch up because uh, number uh, one, it'll give more clearance for when it comes out. But number two, it also uh, allows for them to feel it like it's more so coming out of your nose scrunch up oh, give oh a little, god little resistance yep ben, ben, ben. No yeah ben, ben pull it out <laughs> come on ben no. oh, oh god <laughs> i went scrunched the wrong way i scrunched the wrong way i scrunched the wrong way classic so remember uh you guys not a professional <laughs> not a professional professional, professional. nasal flaps <laughs> Nasal flaps. <laughs> uh, so to recap, uh, use a Q-tip if you're gonna try to attempt this. Uh, don't go up, angle it slightly downward and go back uh, until you hit your sinus flap. You'll feel it go in. It's kind of an odd feeling, isn't it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It tickles For sure. a little Definitely bit. It feels like you're tickling the brain. <laughs> yep. I don't know my phone and phone number anymore. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, and you could just feel it uh, slide in, makes it easy. And if you guys are gonna have somebody pull it out, Go ahead, scrunch up your face scrunch just up. a little bit no, uh, uh, and just oh add to the drama go slow it's a lot of fun gentlemen thank you guys so much for joining me uh let's cheers Our one pleasure. more time clink it and drink it boys and i'm gonna have you guys plug drop toberfest one more time for everybody at home <laughs> september oh. 26 yeah drop 26. toberfest it's our version of Oktoberfest. Live, online, but happily in your own living room. Ooh. Nine awesome craft beers from all over California. Some you may have heard of, some you may have not, because we're going all the way up to Sacramento area to bring you back some awesome craft beer. And uh, hey, check us out on lastjobbeerfestival.com. And check all the socials. Everything's gonna be down below. Check them out. Hit up there if you want to see a playlist we put together just for you. And right over there, let's see what uh, YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thanks for watching. Keep making that magic. <laughs>